Okay, so I'm making hamburger helper for dinner tonight. I've never made hamburger helper for my kids. I grew up on it. The only reason I have this in my house is because I turned 50 this year and I'm celebrating my 50th birthday with things that are also 50. Because I'm so used to doing things from scratch, I have my hamburger here. Oh, like I said, because I do things from scratch, I'm gonna soup this up. So I'm gonna add garlic to it. I really like garlic. I'm gonna cut up two peppers. I chose an orange one and a yellow one for color. So let's get those cut up. Take out the centers. All right, I'm gonna chop these up. Sometimes also when I notice some things are getting old in the fridge, I will come up with a recipe because I hate wasting stuff, especially when there's 10 of us. I don't like wasting food, so. All right, let's cut those. All right, I'm gonna stick these in my pot. Oh, I got a big one there. All right. Let's cut this other one. So I'm making a souped up Hamburger helper. All right, there we go. Now I'm gonna do the yellow one. So my son Gideon, he's at football practice. Robert's grocery shopping. David's at work. Josh, he's riding a horse. Um, Haley and Noah are painting the barn. Isabella is in the kitchen here watching me. She is actually looking up some things for her pineapple plant she bought. You should show them to them. Show them the pineapple plant. I'll have her grab it while I'm cutting this and she can show it to you. She named him Fred. Go ahead. No, I'm not lying. All right, throw that away. All right. She was trying to be quiet. She thought I was live. We'll cut that. This is my daughter, Isabella. She's 15. Show them your plant. That's Fred. It's her pineapple plant. I guess it takes about 12 to 18 months to grow a pineapple. Okay, and so now I'm gonna cut two onions into it. All the recipe says is to add milk and water but and the hamburger, but I am going to add extra stuff. So if you know if that's all you can get is is box stuff, there is a way to make it a little healthier by adding stuff to it. And I'm probably gonna do um, a salad with it just to give us some you know lots of veggie, veggies to go with it. So I'm curious. I don't know how my kids are gonna like it, but they might not even notice since I'm adding all my own stuff to it. My mom and my mother-in-law really helped me when I got married. Um, helping me with recipes, giving me tips on things. Um, they both taught me how to can, so I can a lot of my own food. I'm kind of making a mess here. Sorry about that, you guys. Um, but they taught me a lot of stuff when I got married to help me out because I really didn't do a lot of cooking when before I got married. I didn't do a lot of cooking, but I have eight children. We adopted seven children from um, foster care, or six from foster care, one through private adoption. So I have a lot of kids that want to eat. I have six boys. And so I just had to learn to make big meals. I had to learn to make things from scratch. All right, so we'll get these onions in there. Get that cooking. Okay, I had to go find my chopper. I got this chopper from Pampered Chef, love, love, love. So we're gonna let this cook. I 
think Josh is calling you. Okay, we'll let that start cooking. Get a spatula here to stir this in. So the first step it says is to cook the ground beef. So that's what I'm doing. But like I said, I added onions, garlic, and um, red and yellow peppers. You can use red peppers, you can use green peppers if you want. I'm all about fast and easy. I am not someone that loves to cook, but I sure love my family to love what I'm cooking. So I'm also gonna add some minced uh, onion, sprinkle it in there. And then I'm gonna add some butter, just because I really like butter with you know, noodles and things like that. So my staples that I normally use every time I cook is um, garlic, onion, minced onion, um, and peppers. I kind of use that a lot. And then I also use Bragg sometimes in some of our dishes. All right, so I'm gonna continue cooking that until all the hamburger is brown. Looks like I'm pretty close here. All right. Okay, so the meat is all cooked, so now it's telling us that we need to drain it. So I'm gonna go drain the juice from it. Now it says to add the noodles and the sauce and milk and hot water. So we'll put the noodles in first. So I did both because we have 10 people. Let me turn that, there we go. So I did both of them. Let's cut this. There we go. And then, Sauce packets. My kids are painting the barn, I told you, so now they're on break right now. I don't know why they're snacking. I'm making dinner. So now I have to add, it says two cups of milk, but because I'm doing two boxes, I'm gonna do four cups. So you add the milk in here. I have a cat that's struggling. Okay, so I'm gonna mix that up. And then I have water to put in here too. So let's mix that in. And I'm gonna also add tomatoes, but I'm gonna add the tomatoes after it's cooked. Okay, there's my water. Okay, so I just microwaved the water. It has to be hot, and so there's three cups. Looks like I'm gonna just make it. I did it. Okay, so I'm gonna mix that carefully so it's not all over my stove. And so after I mix this, I'm gonna turn the burner on and it's gonna simmer and then those noodles are gonna start to absorb the water and the milk. So let's turn that on. All right, and I think it said a simmer, maybe 10 to 20 minutes depending on when the noodles get soft. So we're gonna let that cook. Then I'm gonna add my own cheese to it and my own fresh tomatoes. All right, let's get that going. All right, while that is cooking, I'm gonna go ahead and get my tomatoes chopped up. I like tomato sauce and I like, you know, Italian food, but I don't like fresh tomatoes hot. So that's why I'm gonna um, just add them last so they're just a little warm. I don't like like mushy, warm tomatoes, I don't know. So this will just add a little bit of a, I don't know, a little bit of level of, I don't know, maybe professionalism in the, with the hamburger helper. All right, let's get that other one cut. Plus, I think as you cook tomatoes, if I put them in too early, then they get all mushy and the pulp gets from the skin and then you're basically like, instead of having a nice tomato in your dish, you have like a bunch of skins because the tomatoes have kind of soaked into everything. Okay, so I have that cut. Now we're just gonna wait for this to cook down and then we'll add this and the cheese and then we'll see what my family thinks. Okay, so it's starting to get thick. It's cooking down. The noodles are starting to absorb the, the sauce. This one was the cheeseburger hamburger helper. So 
looking good. All right, we'll keep letting that cook. So that, it's been about 15 minutes. So that's what it looks like about 15 minutes later. So we'll check back on it here in about 10 minutes. Okay, so it's thickening. The noodles look like they're getting done. So I'm actually gonna take the cover off and I'm gonna keep cooking them. Let me just set that there. That way some of the moisture can uh, kind of evaporate out to make it thicker. So it looks like it just has a little bit left. So I think what I'm gonna do now is I'm going to add some more cheese just to make it a little cheesier. Our family loves, 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 loves cheese. So I'm, and that's also gonna help thicken it, I think. So I just have like a Mexican cheese blend. It has a, a queso cheese, Monterey cheese, cheddar cheese, a sadero cheese, I don't know what that is. So I'm just gonna add some cheese to this just to make it a little cheesier because it is cheeseburger hamburger helper. So it's already starting to thicken now that I took the lid off. That looks good. I'm curious how my kids are gonna like it. I don't know, it looks good though. All right. That's already starting to thicken. I'm gonna turn this off and now I'm just gonna let it sit. Right. And then I'm gonna add the tomatoes, the fresh tomatoes. All right, oh, I missed one. There we go. All right, so now I'm just gonna stir those in. Ooh, it's already thickening. All right. That looks good actually pretty good. All right. Okay, there we go. Dinner is served. We'll see what my family thinks now. Okay, Haley, tell me what you think. What do you think? Ha, 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 ha.